Hey guys, today I'm going to be reviewing the return of Drix Yogurt. Let's get into it. Now before I do the review, let me ask you a question. Have you heard of Drix Yogurt? Well, I'm positively sure you all have. Well, all of you have. That's what I meant to say. I got kind of got my words wrong. But there are some out there who haven't heard of Trick Yogurt. And yet, some of them have only heard of the cereal. You know, the Trick cereal? Okay, let me explain like this. Trick Yogurt was a type of yogurt made for kids. They came out in 1992. And yes, that is true. They came out in 1992. I am not kidding. They had a ton of different flavors like Strawberry Banana Bash, Raspberry Rainbow, Triple Cherry Punch. They also had Rainbow Punch, that's what I meant to say and uh, triple cherry. They also had more than just those flavors. They also had cotton candy, bubble gum, and, and sherbet. Wait, did they have bubble gum? Hmm, maybe I'm right, maybe I'm wrong. I did some research the other day, and I found out that Trix yogurt was coming back, which got me confused. And to be honest, I didn't even know they were gone until I learned that they were discontinued in 2013. I was like, Oh, that's why. So today, I went to the store and bought some Trix yogurt. Well, not today. I actually went with my dad to get some stuff for the uh, Independence Day cookout. And that's where I found the Trix yogurt. So, um, these are the current flavors. This one is strawberry, and this one's berry. So, let's get down to the review. Okay, so first, I'm going to try the strawberry. And then I'm gonna try the berry flavor. Now this one right here, this one, this side is like strawberry. I think the other side, the other side is lime. It kind of reminds me of a watermelon splash flavor. And yeah, that was the other tricks flavor. I forgot to mention. Hmm, it's pretty good. Just a little bit of the strawberry and the lime. It's pretty good. I actually like it. This actually tastes like, like I said, like watermelon. It still has that same great taste than back in the 90s. It's pretty good. Okay, so next I'm gonna try the berry flavor. If you look right here, the blue side looks like blue raspberry and the other side looks like grape. This almost spilled. Kind of reminds me of the blue raspberry. Wait, I just said that. See that swirl? That's neat. Wow. That actually had my mind blowing. This flavor? <laughs> wow. This kind of reminds me of when I was a kid eat one of these yogurts. This one, this one tastes really awesome. But don't worry, I still like the strawberry one too. But this one, this takes me way back. This takes me way back into the 90s. Man, I don't know what to say about this. This one takes the cake. So, which one do I like the best? I would have to say I'll have to say this one, because this one has that nostalgic flavor to it. And you know, I kind of said that earlier that it takes me way back into the 90s. It hits you right here. It hits you right here in the heart. This one, I think this is better. I still like the strawberry kind, because it has that, it reminds me of that watermelon splash flavor that Trix used to have. And it, it really hits you. It packs that. This one packs a punch. This one packs, I mean, this one right here packs a little punch to it. But this one packs a real good punch. Okay, guys. So my question for today is, what is your favorite Trix yogurt flavor? Be sure to comment below and I'll be sure to respond to all of them. And some of them might be my favorite too, you know. I also want to give a shout out to Multimaster, the guy who talks about all the retro games. Tim Nidal, who's best known for his Saturday Morning Rewind podcast. And the Nostalgia Society, who's best known for showing all the 90s cartoons and the promos and the commercials. 
Okay guys, I'm gonna finish up the yogurt, and in the meantime, I thank you for tuning into this video. Now I might not post as much next week because I'm gonna be going on vacation with my family. We might I might post a few pictures and do a lot of videos. Well, not not a lot of videos, but uh just a few. And also, I'm gonna be going to a wrestling event on the 28th in Charlotte. So that's gonna be fantastic. I've been wanting to go to a wrestling event ever since I was young. So yeah, it's gonna be pretty fun. Anyways guys, thanks for tuning in. Y'all keep it retro. I'll see you on the next video. Peace.